Bible verses about hard work. And whatsoever ye do, do it heartily, as to the Lord, and not unto men. Colossians chapter 3, verse 23. The soul of the sluggard desireth, and hath nothing, but the soul of the diligent shall be made fat. Proverbs chapter 13, verse 4. For even when we were with you, this we commanded you, that if any would not work, neither should he eat. 2 Thessalonians chapter 3, verses 10 to 12. I can do all things through Christ, which strengtheneth me. Philippians chapter 4, verse 13. In all labor there is profit, but the talk of the lips tendeth only to penury. Proverbs chapter 14, verse 23. Do all things without murmurings and disputings. Philippians chapter 2. Verses 14 to 15. Commit thy works unto the Lord, and thy thoughts shall be established. Proverbs chapter 16, verse 3. Whether therefore ye eat or drink, or whatsoever ye do, do all to the glory of God. 1 Corinthians chapter 10, verse 31. And that ye study to be quiet, and to do your own business, and to work with your own hands, as we commanded you. 1 Thessalonians chapter 4, verses 11 to 12. The hand of the diligent shall bear rule, but the slothful shall be under tribute. Proverbs chapter 12, verse 24. For with God, Nothing shall be impossible. Luke chapter 1, verse 37. And whatsoever ye do, in word or deed, do all in the name of the Lord Jesus, giving thanks to God and the Father by him. Colossians chapter 3, verse 17. Knowing that of the Lord ye shall receive the reward of the inheritance, for ye serve the Lord Christ. Colossians chapter 3, verse 24. Whatsoever thy hand findeth to do, do it with thy might, for there is no work, nor device, nor knowledge, nor wisdom, in the grave, whither thou goest. Ecclesiastes chapter 9, verse 10. But if any provide not for his own, and specially for those of his own house, he hath denied the faith, and is worse than an infidel. 1 Timothy chapter 5, verse 8 With good will doing service, as to the Lord, and not to men. Ephesians chapter 6, verse 7 Go to the ant, thou sluggard, consider her ways, and be wise. Proverbs chapter 6, verses 6 to 8. In all things showing thyself a pattern of good works, in doctrine, showing uncorruptness, gravity, sincerity. Titus chapter 2, verses 7 to 8. The husbandman that laboreth, must be first partaker of the fruits. 2 Timothy chapter 2, verse 6 And let us not be weary in well-doing, for in due season we shall reap if we faint not. Galatians chapter 6, verse 9 